Hi, in today's video we will see the U mask and how it works. So you see it will uh, by the end of the video we, you will be able to do something that, will, that looks like this. So to understand this effect, you first need to understand how mask the uh, blending works. When you s when you put uh, a color on blending, it will add its value, like its uh, RGB value, like uh, here uh, you can see this value with the mod I have. Uh, it will add its value to the value of any other object it, uh, it it's So like you can see here, it adds the two values together. So to make this effect work, we'll need a, a two local, a low, uh, uh, low uh, brightness, so very dark colors, uh, with the same same uh, brightness uh, as each other. But uh, you can do it with different hues and uh, just don't touch these two sliders here. Just change uh, the the hue. So when you add a color uh, with its opposite. Uh, you will obtain a gray like this. So with the two, uh, since these two, these two colors have the same uh, darkness and saturation values, you can do this and invert the colors like this, put this on a layer under, so B3, and now you will get this gray. Let me remove the grid. So now you have this this gray and you can put basically anything behind uh, behind all of this and it will look uh, it will not uh, disturb the effect but now you need to have a solid object uh, with the same color as this so now you can see it has the exact same color and when you put it on b3 it will be above the invert mask so uh, yeah this is the top one it's on b2 this one is the bottom one on b3 so you can see it appears this thing appears under this and above this so when you put the two together this object serves as a mask for this pattern so now we, what you can do is take the another pattern, so now we'll use uh, this simple pattern, put it on B3, it will appear below this, and when you put the three, the three on top and you do this, it, look like, it looks like it didn't appear, but if you take your... Uh, let me organize this better. So now I'm just making the pattern. You have this linked. This linked. Now, you, when you put your object right here, it looks like nothing changed. Make it a bit smaller. You can rotate it like this. And now, when you take a pattern and you rotate it, you will see, oh, something appears. And, uh, I, I think it's a really cool effect because you can do it in like uh, blocks and all. And it's really easy to do once you understand it. So, to recap, we need two colors with the same darkness and saturation. We, we can make uh, any pattern we want. So, like, let's make this checkable pattern. Then, you need to invert it and put it on, be on the layer behind. So the inversion is with a 180 U. It looks gray. And now when you put your color, your uh, solid object between the two, it will make the colors appear. So you can be uh, really creative with what pattern you want to use. Uh, uh, it's a really po powerful effect and you can, do, you can use it in a lot of parts. So, thanks for watching. See ya!